And welcome back. This is Baller Scuba with another live StarCraft 2 commentary. I'm hoping, hoping, hoping that I can find a good opponent. Did I say a opponent? That's because I want to rank a opponent. Yeah, the last uh, the last video I aired, hopefully it rendered properly. I don't actually know. I haven't gone back and checked it. I'm just moving on straight from one game to another. Um, the last one I faced a silver opponent and a gold opponent, and I figured since they were actually really short games and against really bad opponents, um, just air them both in a row. So I'm up against Steve-O Steve. What's up Steve-O Steve? He is a Zerg player. Uh, we're going to be on Shat the Shattered Temple. Um, for those of you new, or, well, that have been out of the loop for a little bit, it's Lost Temple. Not little tweaks news. here and there, but news. it's Lost Temple. Okay, so up against a Zerg player, Lost Temple, two racks expand. Calling it right now. I'm calling it. It does well for me against Zerg players lately. I, I, I don't know why. No, like, honestly. It should not work for me. If they go for any kind of early aggression, I am screwed. But they don't. At this level, you know, they're they're confident in either a hatch or I scare them off with my bunker. It's crazy. I don't know what's going on lately with Zerg players, but they are not the fearsome early opponents that I remember. And instead, they're the fearsome late opponents that I don't remember. I am confused with Zerg players. There's no other way to put it. My barracks is late because I'm too busy talking to you guys about what Zerg players used to be. You know, I feel like an old man. When I was your age, Zerg players were, were formidable in the early game. Where the hell's my rocking chair? No, get back on it. He left. He's scared. Uh, so let's see, is he in the south? No. Go north. He should notice that there's no racks up. There, there's no gas up, sorry. And he should be scared. Be scared! I don't think he is. He doesn't listen to me. How much health you got left? Alright, that's enough. So, there we go. He is in the north. Spine pull on the way. What? Okay, um, I, I don't know what to make of this. Once again, con confused. Spawning pull out. It's at a very strange timing. Um, yeah, just, oh, I never got the Marines out. Five, eh, uh, five, eh. Uh. There we go. There we go. There we go. Alright. Bunker gonna go... Yeah. In the kind of a narrow part there. No! Dude! Holy shit! That was like seven or eight Zerglings! I'm gonna guess eight because they always seem to come in round numbers. I can't figure it out. Three rocks, baby! Now... Last time, I don't want to spoil it, but I got that bunker up just in friggin' time. So hopefully I can do that this time again, too. He actually didn't focus down the SUV that was supposed to be building the bunker. Like he should have. Yeah, whatever. Roger.
Alright. Here we go. And T-Rex expansion up. Um Insufficient Vespian gas. You suck with Vespian gas. Shut up, you guys. I know what I'm doing. Don't I know what I'm doing? I don't know if I do. Add on complete. What was I thinking? Oh. Um, yeah, I meant the old man thing. Um, what was I think? Uh. Add on complete. Um, I had a one of my co workers call in sick today, and that kind of stuff always cracks me up because. Whenever somebody calls in sick, it instantly becomes this, um, for lack of a better word, it's a toughness contest. You know what I mean, like, sick, you don't know what sick is. One day I was, uh, one day I had both my legs amputated, and then I had to, I was going undergoing chemotherapy, and I was giving birth. And I'm a dude, so it was really hard. And but I still made it to work the next day. I hobbled myself on in, and I was in the snow, and it was uphill both ways, and I had to walk. It's like, dude, I don't care. It probably didn't even happen, anyways. But what is it about? Being somebody just saying the word sick that instantly drives people to be ultra defensive about how about their sicknesses and kind of be aggressive. I don't know what you guys know what I'm talking about, right? I'm not just pulling stuff out of my butt, am I? Well, I do that later on, but you guys don't get to see that because I can get my webcam to work. I charge five ninety nine a minute. I'm not even making sense anymore, am I? Uh, what did I get here? Oh, nothing. That's right. Got a whole lot of nothing. Let's go ahead and transfer quite a few of you. Oh god, if this opponent sucks again, I'm gonna be pissed. The only thing he could come at me with right now would be um, that I did. Uh, I wouldn't see coming would be missile turret. It would be mutas. So let's get those missile turrets back up. So missile turret, missile turret. Everything else I am pretty much prepared for. Yeah, supply depots. I know. Additional supply depots required. I got an upgrade here, right? Um, oh my god. Okay, if this guy is as bad as I think he is, based on my opponents today, this should wipe him out. The hell? You got an overlord? Bread and creep? No. Okay, well. Additional supply depots. Here it comes. Uh, okay, he is not as bad as I thought. Look at all those mutas. Damn, Steve O oh Steve. You're not as bad as I thought. Um, holy crap, I got a legitimate opponent. I don't know what to do anymore. Yeah, butter his biscuits. Gonna get two racks, or two factories here. Bad news. 
I'm already all <laughs> supply locked again. Never got the gas here. Never got the gas here. That is way too much crap right there, so I'm trying to catch up. What I need is a raven. Mineral field depleted. Okay, starport. Yes, you need to keep doing that. Alright, let's go for... Yeah, there's still rocks there. Let's go for this one. There we go. Starting to get back into this thing. Uh, he surprised me. That's that's the real only way to put it. I am shocked. Crap, he's got the creep all the way up to my freaking base. That's not cool. Those numbers are still way too high. And I'm already supply locked. I'm still supply locked, I should say. Um, so Raven almost done. Raven. Siege tanks. I'm out of gas? Man, that is a lot of creep that he has spread. I hope he's able to to match that with some in-game performance. You know, a lot of Zerg players that I face, um, not naming names, the last couple ones, uh, they might have been able to do certain aspects well, but they don't necessarily... Uh, let's go for Hellions then. They can't necessarily do anything else with it. For instance, where's the Raven? Fuck. That is a fucking flock, man. Yeah, it's in the red. Complete. Guess what? Additional supply depots required. Repaired, bitch. Mineral field depleted. Where's the raven? There's the raven. It's in there. Ready to blunder. Ready for service. Awaiting orders. Commencing. Fuck, I stemmed when I didn't need to. Fuck. Dude. 
Not paying attention to the fucking banelings, man. Banelings will do me in every time. That and my own lack of macro. Fucking give me Vikings, please. Depleted. What's going? Add on. He's got creep all over the fucking map, man. Hopefully that's gonna do it for me. Fucking meters, man. Mineral field depleted. Been waiting on you. SCV ready. Our SCVs are under attack. Ready to plunder. Of course. Orders received. Fuck. That's game, man. He won this. Good game. Nicely done, sir. Yeah, um... Wow. Lots for me to do in that game that I just didn't. Uh, even match... Come on, Diamond. Tell me he's a Diamond. He is a Diamond. So, the game thinks I'm Diamond, apparently. It also wants to freeze on me. He is ranked 20th in his diamond division. Great player, actually. On a little bit of a losing streak, so uh, apparently I gave him some uh, some good stuff to think about. Yeah, there was so much that I just didn't do in that game that I really should have. I need to. He probably had about four bases up by the time I went for my first push. That is not a good time. Um, when I went for that first initial push, I didn't micro. I didn't micro at all this game. Uh, maybe that's because it's late. Maybe that's because I suck. Probably a combination of both. Um, yeah, nothing, nothing against him. He played that very well. Got a huge flock of mutas. Muta Bailey Ling. Um, it worked well for him. So yeah, Steve O. Steve ranked 20th in his diamond division, 1911 points, 138 wins, 113 losses. Hope you guys have enjoyed this game. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned from my mistakes. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.